What's up everyone? So I'm kind of making this video over my own personal experience that after all these things are starting to come to light, I gotta say it looks really shady on FedEx's end. Now let me explain. I got a PlayStation 5 disk drive, uh, exclusive Sony invite for pre-orders, direct from Sony. Uh, I, I bought it the day that the pre-order came out uh, and had my, I did get my PS5 on launch day. Um, but let me give you a background real quick. I own my own company, Audio Gods, as you may be able to see there, and I buy and sell car audio. FedEx and UPS, know me by heart. They know where I live. They know my address. They know who I am. They see me regularly. I'm constantly getting deliveries for enclosures and subwoofers and equipment that I need to do installations for customers. So confusing my address should never be a problem. I've been doing this for years. And uh, there's only, I live in a small community. So there's only three, four FedEx drivers here. So I'm waiting for my PS5 to come. And it's the day of delivery. I can hear the FedEx. We, I live on a you know small little area with a brick road. And I can hear their bigger trucks over normal traffic. So I listen for it. And uh, I, I hear the FedEx truck. So I'm waiting, sitting in my door. The uh, FedEx driver, I, I caught her in time coming from my neighbor's house. And just starting to drive off. So I flagged her down. Hey, hey, hey. She stops. Yeah. I said, uh, you should have a package here for me. She's like, uh, I, uh, let me check. I said, no, I have a PS5. It's coming today. It says that it is en route now. And you're the delivery driver for this route. So uh, where's my PS5? So lo and behold, she goes into the truck. Finds it instantly, within seconds. Oh, yep, I, I have one here for you. She hands it to me and starts to walk off. I say, well, wait, I'm supposed to sign for this. Oh, no, I, I actually, I, I delivered it next door to your neighbor by accident, and they signed for it. But then they told me it wasn't their package, so I put it back on the truck. So you don't need to sign. It's been signed for. I said, well, that's not my signature. I took the PS5. I didn't make a bigger issue about it than that. I was happy. I got my PS5 at least. But none of these issues of cat food and George Foreman grills and dead hooker bodies showing up in PS5 deliveries had come out yet at this point. Now that it has, I'm like, you know, that's really funny because they've never mixed my address up. They know who I am by first and last name. They already signed my package as being delivered but the neighbor told them, I, this isn't mine. I didn't order this. Um, and they put it back on their truck and were just going to drive off with my PS5. Had I not caught her ready to drive off and ran out there flailing my arms like a madman, like, hey, where's my shit? I really doubt I would have ever saw my PS5. I really, and it, I already signed for it, even though I never saw, signed for it. So... Uh, my whole point in this is I really think FedEx is up to some shady shit. I don't think it's Amazon. I think it's FedEx delivery drivers. And I was that close to having the same shit happen to me. Thank God it didn't. But man, I really feel for everyone else out there who has. That was my experience. I got lucky. Um, but like I said, no reason to confuse my address. You guys have been here three times a week, every week for the last three years. Um, you know who I am by first name. And then the fact that you already signed my package and didn't require my actual signature, that's shady, dude. Uh, so FedEx, you need to tighten the reins on your drivers and employees and maybe do a retrain. A lot of people are missing out on their consoles and money during a time of pandemic. Well, what the fuck else do they have to really do? Um, and, you know, it's just not right. So uh, that's it. I just wanted to share that story and uh, maybe shed a little bit more light on the situation. Thank you for watching and stay updated because PS5 VR content will be coming very soon. Thank you.